I'm Dr. Jeffrey Lyman with the Orthopedic Specialty Institute in Coeur d'Alene, Idaho, and I'm going to be talking a little bit about macoplasty partial knee replacements today. The macoplasty robotic arm system is a tool that we use to increase the accuracy in the placement of implants with partial knee replacement surgery. By their very nature, partial knee replacements need to be extremely precise in placement. The macoplasty uses the information that's gathered from a CT scan and combines it with computer navigation to create a preoperative plan that is very precise to the patient's bone structure. The macoplasty robot then uses this information and in preoperative plan to remove a very precise amount of bone to accommodate an implant that's designed specifically for the patient. The Makoplasty technology allows for a customizable solution for any patient who has unicompartmental or, or bicompartmental arthritis. So preparing for surgery, we almost always start with x-rays and a clinical evaluation, and I frequently get an MRI scan to make sure the quality of the cartilage in the non-affected compartments of the knee are normal. After that, a CT scan is absolutely necessary to gather data for the robot so that preoperative surgical planning can be performed. Next comes the day of surgery. Trackers are necessary to communicate with the robot. These are connected to the tibia and femur through two small stab incisions on the tibia and femur outside of the incision used for the placement of the implant. Arrays are attached to these pins and they communicate directly with the computer. Once the knee is exposed, anatomic data points are entered visually into the computer so that it can tell where the leg is in space. The computer uses this information to make sure that its calibration is correct. Next, all bony cuts are performed with the use of a high-speed Onspock burr. This allows us to remove a very minimal amount of bone and make a very accurate bony resection. Once the bony cuts are prepared, the implants can be cemented into place. All of our patients so far have been discharged home directly and do outpatient physical therapy the day after discharge. It's not uncommon for patients to feel better than they did before surgery within five to seven days of surgery. Physical therapy is usually necessary for four to six weeks. Thank you for listening to this presentation on macoplasty partial knee replacement at the Orthopedic Specialty Institute in Coeur d'Alene, Idaho. We're very excited to offer this technology to patients in our region.